So, if you're in for learning about the possibility of successfully turning your life into something even more amazing than it is now, raise your hand. Yay! <laughs> so, I promise, um, I promise that I'm really going to give you everything I can in this time that we have together. And I know that there's going to be some of you that are going to want to go deeper with it and that you're going to want to integrate some of it into your life. And for those of you who do, then I am going to, um, I have a, a great gift for you that I'm going to share with you at the end of the presentation that you're really going to love. So what is Diamond Power? Well, I believe, as I said, this is Diamond Power. And I believe that each of you is a diamond that at the core of who you are is a beautiful diamond gem. It is your connection to infinite love that's going to support you and give you strength to overcome anything that you encounter in life. And this is your diamond power, but you know what happens? In our lifetime, we go through curveballs, you know, nobody skates through life, we all have disappointments. And so what happens is that diamond gets buried, and we forget who we are. And like, you know, no two diamonds are alike, and so no two women are alike. So when you clear away the sludge, what happens is you start to uncover your gifts and your talents and your unique traits. In order to, uh, to begin anywhere in life with what to really move you forward into a life that you would love, you have to get clear. You've got to design a life that you would absolutely love, and you have to figure out who are you in that life. So write this down. Clarity is power. When you become clear on what it is that you really want, then you're going to see all sorts of opportunities show up for you, resources, people turn up for you. It's really getting a clear vision of what that looks like. And you want to also discover who are you. So let's start by getting clear about who are you. You want to pinpoint words that would identify who is that woman who you know is deep down inside of you and who is really uh, embodies the essence of the woman you want to be in this dream. So normally I, I take uh, my, my sparkle people through a process, but today let's brainstorm. Think about some adjectives that you really love that would absolutely identify the woman that you would love to be. And think about this too in, in the terms of uh, who you would be when you're going through, who you would love to be when you're going through a change, something that's really taken you, you know, Shift you up, taking you out. Who do you want to be in that scenario? Tammy realized that if she was ever really going to change, she needed support. And so she decided to, to take a big leap. And she decided that she really wanted her dream. And so she made a decision and she enrolled in the Sparkle program. And basically, if you looked at her life and the conditions of her life, you know, you might think that this was a tough decision for her, but she wanted that dream, and she decided to go for it. So Tammy told me that she really wanted this deeply loving relationship. However, in the same breath, she would say, but you know what? I don't know that that's ever going to happen again for me because she really felt so horrible about herself after this marriage. She felt that she was undesirable, unlovable, and would want her, basically. And so we started, as we do, with, with the vision. So we decided, okay, let's, just, let's create a vision of what that relationship would look like, and let's create a vision of who you would be in that relationship. And it was hard for her. You know, she kept wanting to go back to, well, I don't see how that's going to happen. I said, look, let's just, let's just forget about the how, and let's just create, what would that look like for you? So she got on board for that, and, which was important because, you know, you need a mental picture. You need to get very clear, crisp specificity about what you want because the mind thinks in pictures. And so when you're able to connect with that, you're, you're opening up the chances of, of welcoming that in to your life, which is really, really important. So with some coaching, she got clear. And 
she got clear on what it looked like and what it felt like, but she was still having thoughts around, oh, I don't know who would want me, you know, I'm divorced, two small kids, and she was feeling insecure about it. And I wanted her to open up her mind a little bit to it, so I was saying to her, well, is there a part of you that could open up to this and, and think, you know, what it would, that there is a possibility, if there was that, what would you do? And she kept saying, well, oh, you know, I just don't know. It just doesn't seem possible. So we looked at her beliefs and we started working to reframe those beliefs because they, that was where her mindset was going. And as long as your mindset keeps going to the impossible, then it's very difficult to see any possibility of an opening at all. And so we next looked at, okay, what are these beliefs and how can we change them? Because I'm sure you know you have a dream that you want. I mean, how many of you have dreams right now that you want? And yeah, lots of you, most of you. And you might have a belief that's stopping you. Right? You might have a belief. And think about this, when that belief, when you have a limiting belief, it's almost like, a, you know when a hose, when you're running water through a hose and it kinks, it twists, and nothing moves through it, right? It just stops, it's like a tourniquet. So this is what happens when you have a belief it's, that's, that's a limiting belief. It's got you stopped, kind of clogged. And there's a saying, you can never solve a problem at the level it was created. So you've got to get up above it. You've got to open up to that part of you where that part of you that sees possibility and that, you know, open up that, that hose again and just let the, you know, let the ideas and the thoughts flow because it's those ideas that are from that possibility that are going to support the dream that you have and that are going to help you get there.